day we've all been waiting for. The annual ski meet will be held this afternoon. First prize for the high scorer will be $500. This contest is open to everyone. Right. Now we can use my jet propel skis. Gosh! On the bottom of each ski, there's a tiny rocket engine, see? You control them with this switch hidden in your pocket. With these skis, you're sure to win the contest. And now for the next event, the ski jump. The first jumper will be rock bottom. A terrific jump, folks! Terrific! The next jumper will be Felix the Cat. I'll have to go some to beat rock skiing. Here goes! An elastic band. So that's it. Somehow, I have a feeling that the professor is behind this. I'll start over again. What a sensational jump, folks! Sensational! The score is tied between Rock and Felix. It all depends on the final event, a ski race down Breakneck Mountain. Hmm, <laughs> it looks kind of dangerous from here. Don't worry, Rock. I'll confuse Felix by changing one of the arrows that mark the course. Felix is in the lead, folks. Here he comes. I better get busy. The big ski meet is almost over. The final race down Breakneck Mountain is now in progress. Rock Bottom and Felix the Cat are fighting for first place. And what? Why, that's funny. Felix has disappeared. Oh, oh. Felix went over the cliff. I can't lose now. Oh, 
about to cross the finish line. has just crossed it to win the race. Congratulations, Felix. Thanks, Judge. I'm sorry the professor couldn't be here to see this. ships to conquer the earth and no rocket fuel powerful enough to take them there if i only had poindexter super rocket fuel but alas he's on earth out of my reach huh who are you, insignificant one? I am Martin the Martian, sir, and I would like to join forces with you. With me? Why? Well, if you invade Earth, you'll leave Mars to us Martians. Hmm, true. But how can you help me? I can go to Earth and get that Poindexter for you. Fine, fine. Then it's agreed. If I bring Poindexter, you leave Mars forever. Yes, yes. But how are you going to get to Earth? Easy. With one of my fourth dimension space capsules. It's really very simple. Observe. <laughs> Sherman Tank. Gee, that was a good book. But those Martians. <laughs> huh? That's a strange box. There's something funny going on around here. No, uh, no, no, Mr. Felix. Stop. <laughs> comes the space capsule. What? Felix? You? Whom did you expect? Okay, wise guy. Oh! Oh, no! Hey, why are you doing this to me? Why? I'll tell you why. 
I sent a Martian to bring me Poindexter, and you show up. I get it. You want Poindexter's super rocket fuel formula so you can invade the Earth. Correct, wise guy. <laughs> these rockets and no rocket fuel to carry them to Earth. Well, I'm back, Master Cylinder. Poindexter agreed to come to Mars in my space capsule and make his rocket fuel. Well, start working. Okay, Mr. Cylinder. Well, Master, I did my part. Now you pay off. Pay off? Sure. Where? Hey, haven't I seen you before? I am Martin the Martian. Oh, do you know how to get out of here? Sure. Watch. Yikes! We Martians can do anything if we really try. Now, let's find your friend, Poindexter. Here's your super rocket fuel, Master Cylinder. But be careful. That stuff is dangerous. Cylinder. He's heading for a rocket ship. Yes, for number one, the big one. The rocket control. There he goes. Nice going, Mr. Felix. Poinsy boy, are you okay? Yes, Mr. Felix, but awfully sleepy. It must be midnight for you, Earthmen. Here, go on home. The space capsule! At your service, gentlemen. Goodbye, Martin. Thanks.
Here, Professor. I got the money. Good. Now we can go on our vacation. Did you have trouble borrowing it? Yeah. He wouldn't give it to me, so I took it. What? I told you to get it legally. But, Professor, it was so easy. There is a better way. Ah, Felix the Cat loans, and there's the safe. Seventeen, twenty-one, nine. The Professor! Felix, I want to apologize for Rock's rude behavior. Thanks, Professor. Not at all. You were in there a long time. A shot of oxygen will fix you up. Uh, Professor, take the money. Thanks. The oxygen is wearing off. And I gave him the money. Okay, Snipper, trace him. <laughs> Sniffer's been gone a long time. Oh, here they come. Give us your money, Phoenix. Good work, Sniffer. How did you do it? here at the North Pole. Six months, the same as the nights. Six months. Rock, we're in for ten years. Ten years? Then we'll never catch Felix and the walrus. And if we don't, we'll never get the ten thousand dollars. Uh, Professor, what's these bars made of? Same as everything else here. Ice. Hmm, ice. Rock, have you a nice pick? Yeah, Professor, right here in my pocket. Then start shipping. We're breaking out. How are you doing, Walter? Ooh, 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 ooh. I get it. You're hungry. But how can I get you food? There's nothing but ice here. Okay, okay. I'll think of something. I gotta get him some fish, but how? I got it. Way 
to prosperity. Yeah, shoving Felix under the ice was a smart move. Yes, now we can sell his walrus to the zoo for $10,000. <laughs> I'm sure scared that fish away. And it keeps me from drowning, too. But I gotta get out of here fast. This ice is solid. If I only had a saw. Huh? A sawfish. Hmm. Don't worry, fella. I just want to borrow your saw. go. Tracks. They went that away. But it's a long walk on this slick ice. If I had some skates, but I haven't. What I need is an ice bicycle. An icicle. Hey, Professor. What's that mountain? It's a mountain of ice called the Great Barricade. Gee, Professor, how are we going to get over that? We'll have to climb it. What about our walrus? We'll carry him over. Are you all right, Professor? I'll show you. It's easy, Rock. Bring the walrus. <laughs> Professor, you slipped. It's no use, Rock. That ice is as slick as ice. Look, something is coming. Felix, you're careless. You knocked Rock cold. Yeah, that's just too bad. Anyway, you're trapped. Nobody can get over the ice barrier. Well, I'm somebody, and I'm getting out of here right now. Braggart. Hey, Professor, do you miss anything? No, but unless my eyes deceive me, we've both missed the boat. Ah -ha! 